Ok Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Dan salam sejahtera Ok now we go to the new topic here Here is a division I have one question here Question number one 24 divided by 2 Ok now we arrange this number 24 divided by 2 Ok now the number inside is a dividend The number outside is a divisor Ok If you want solve this question for division, we must look at the divisor. The divisor here is a number 2. So, we must have a timetable 2 here. Okay. 1 times 2, 2. 2 times 2, 4. 3 times 2, 6. 4 times 2, 8. 5 times 2, 10. 6 times 2 is 12. 7 times 2 is 14. 8 times 2 is 16. Okay, we stop at 16 first. Okay, now we continue. The first number here is a number 2. Okay, the first number here is a number 2. Now we want to do the division. We must find the number 2 here Okay So we already found here The number 2 here already So put number 2 We put minus And make a line And then we look at here What number times by 2 become 2 So the answer will be 1 Put 1 here And then we minus become 0 2 minus 2 become 0 now, we we'll bring down number 4 And then we must find number 4 in the timetable 2 Okay, we look at here We already found timetable And we already found number 4 in the timetable 2 So, put number 4 Put minus back a line And then we look we, And we must find what number times by 2 become number 4 So, the answer is 2 so put 2 here So 4 minus 4 equals to 0 Okay Now 0 is a reminder 2 is the quotient or the answer So how to write the answer Is the reminder is 0 You no need to put reminder here Okay So the answer will be 12 Okay, easy right? So we go to with the next question The next question is 16 divided by 3 So 16 divided by 3 The divisor is number 3 So we must have timetable 3 here 1 times 3 is 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, and 21. Okay, we stop at 21 first. Okay, now we do the first number here The first number here is a number 1 It's a possible to find number 1 here Okay, it's a very impossible to find number 1 here Because the first number for timetable 3 is number 3 Okay, so we must start at For the both number here, 16 Okay, we found We must find number 16 here Okay, so I find and I don't find any number 16 But I found the nearest number The nearest number is a 15 and 18 Okay, the 15 and 18 
So let me think about it. If I choose number 18 and I put here, we cannot do the minus operation because 18 is a bigger than 16. So if I put number six, uh, number 15 here, so we can do the minus operation. So the number 15. Put 15 here, put minus, make a line. So now, what number times by 3 equals to 15? The number is 5. So, where should I put number 5? Whether here or here. Okay? So the answer is, must be here. Because we do add the 2 number, so we choose here. Put 5 here. Okay? So now... 16 minus 15, the answer will be 1. The remainder is 1. So the answer will be like this. Okay, 5 remainder 1. Okay, very easy, right? Okay, now we go to the next question. Question number 3 Okay For the hard question 327 Divided by 3 By 3 327 Divided by 3 So The first thing you must to do is Reach the number you look at the divisor, the divisor is a number 3. So 1 times 3 equals to 3, 2 times 3 equals to 4, 3 times eh, 6, 9, 4 times 3 equals to 12, 5 times 3 equals to 15, 18, 21 24 27 And the last one is a 30 Now we look at here The first number is number 3 So we can find number 3 in a timetable 3 here So I found already number 3 here So I put 3 Put minus Make a line what number times by 3 equals to 3? So, the answer is 1. So, put 1 here. Because we do the first number, put it here. Okay? Now, 3 times... Uh, 3 minus 3 equals to 0. Now, we bring down number 2. Put 2 here. It's a very impossible to find number 2 in time table 3. Because the first number for time table 3 is... a. Uh, 3 So we bring down another number 7 Ok here You must listen carefully If you bring another number Down So the number here will be 0 Ok The, num the other number here will be 0 Ok we look at here We must find number 27 At time table 3 So we already found it 27 Put minus Make a line What number times by 3 Equals to 27 Is a 20 is a, is a number 9 So put 9 here Ok So 27 Minus 27 The answer will be 0 So the answer will be 109 it's very easy, right? Okay. So, question number 4. Okay, make a line. Okay, question number 4 will be like this. Okay. Okay. 286 divided by 4. 286 divided by 4 The divisor is a number 4 
So we must have a timetable for Okay, we stop at 40. Now we must do the first number here. The first number here is a number 2 and it's a very impossible to find number 2 in the timetable 4 because the first number for the timetable 4 is a number 4. So we must do for the two number here. So 28. So now we must find number 28 in the timetable 4. Okay, we already found it, 28 here. So put 28, put minus back line. So what number times by 4 become 28? So the number will be 7. I cannot put here because I do for two number. So I must write here. So, 28 minus 28 becomes 0. So, bring down number 6. Now, we must find number 6 in timetable 4. Okay, here I already find, but I cannot find, I, I cannot find number 6 here. So, the nearest number will be number 8 and number 4. If I choose number 8, I cannot do the minus operation because 8 is bigger than 6. So the suitable number to put here is a number 4. So 6 minus 4 equals to 2. Here put 4, here put 1. Because 1 times 4 is 4. Okay. So now 2 is a reminder. Okay, so the answer will be 71 reminder 2. Okay? okay. So I already give a four example. Now I want to give you uh, some exercise so you can look at the exercise I given and you can do at the paper and then take a picture and send to me.